Newark, New Jersey. When I was a kid, guys like me were brought up to follow codes. Hey, jerk off. What'd you say? What? Antonio Soprano. I wonder if I can talk to you alone for a moment, Mrs. Soprano? On the basis of the Sanford Binet, he's high IQ. You can't prove it by me. He's got a D plus average. Well, he doesn't apply himself, but he is smart. The results tell us he's a leader. Ankle dick. Growing up with the family. Takes a toll. Maybe an ambassador to England or France. You're my nephew. My life to gamble. I want to do whatever I can to help you. you may be your business, my, my gift to you. I want to go to college. I can't get caught with shit like this. Look, you take the speakers, right? At the same time, you say to yourself, this is the last time I'm ever going to steal something. It's that simple. Let me go talk to him. He only listens to Dickie. Gotta do something about Dickie Malasani. Maybe some of the things you do aren't God's favorite. <laughs> you lead by example? We make the right decision. This kid's got what it takes. As your nephew goes, I'm listening. Stay out of his life. I just want to mention this, put it out there straight away. Uh, Ray Liotta. Ray Liotta is back at it. In another gangster film. Who doesn't love to see that, right? Ray Liotta, back at it. So, as far as I'm aware of the story, this is a prequel to the original Sopranos. R.I.P. James Gandolfini, he was a great, uh, a great, great actor. As far as I can recall, I do not remember Uncle Dicky as a character in Sopranos. Uh, in the original Sopranos. So, I'm, I'm guessing, is he a new character? Honestly, I forget, was this guy, not this actor, but the character, Uncle Dickie, in the original. I uh, cannot remember that. I do remember Tony Soprano's mother in Sopranos. Um, this is Vera Farmiga, by the way, which I had no idea until toward the end of the trailer. Um, great job on the makeup. Bit of prosthetic there as well, maybe. Um, because I remember Tony Soprano's mom was in was it the first season or the second season maybe the two maybe the first two seasons of sopranos but um i'm pretty sure the original mama soprano won a golden globe as far as i'm aware but vera farmiga looks great here you're looking at leslie odom jr john Burntall, Corey stoll here we go then we have um michael gandolfini ray liotta vera farmiga um, now this is written by David Chase. For people who do not know, David Chase is the creator of the original Sopranos. Uh, this is directed by Alan Taylor. Pretty sure he directed a couple of episodes of The Sopranos as well, and um, other shows like Six Feet Under. So he's a great director. Um, David Chase, like man, this is going to be good, you know, a gangster film. Me personally, I don't get sick of gangster films. This is a prequel to The Sopranos, so it's, it's kind of cool to see, um, a sort of origin story for for Tony Soprano, um, how he got to where he was in the original Sopranos. Is it Oscar worthy? Possibly, possibly. I do get the Oscar worthy vibes from this. Um, bit of a risk, you know, making a film off of the TV series. I know it's a different kind of storyline, prequel and stuff like that, but sometimes it can be a bit of a risk making a movie off of a TV series. Um, but Hopefully this doesn't fail, hopefully this lives up to the potential, and this trailer has enough hype, I feel. Ray Liotta back at it. 
He never gotten a chance to stare in the Irishman, but here he is, staring in the many saints of Newark. I've never seen Michael Gandolfini act before, but um, I can get the vibe from, from this guy though. And I feel from this trailer alone, he kind of gave off um, a great character vibe. And I'm sure he will do justice to Tony Soprano um, and to his father who portrayed Tony Soprano. So honestly, I'm looking forward to this. I have nothing else to say. Um, it doesn't have a release date yet, does it? Only in cinemas. No, it doesn't have a release date. But I'd say you'd be looking at this toward the end of um, toward the end of the year. I feel. Does it say it here? No. Many Saints of Newark. Great cast. Overall, great trailer. And I feel this can be a great gangster film. You know, it really looks great. The cinematography looks fantastic. The use of music in this trailer was very good. Um, Fear Farmiga, she's a great actress. Leslie Odom Jr. getting a lot of roles lately as well. It looks beautiful, man. The way it's shot, it's perfect. You know, and the colors gives off the 1970s, 80s vibes. This film can be as good as um, The Irishman. You never know. I remember Martin Scorsese said one time that he couldn't, he couldn't watch The Sopranos. That uh, he couldn't get used to it for some reason. You know, that's such a diss. How can he say that about Sopranos, man? Sopranos is just uh, it was a masterpiece. And um, I'm really looking forward to seeing this film in full length. I don't know if it's coming to a streaming service. It says only in cinemas here. So I'm guessing we probably have to go to the cinema to watch this. But uh, alright, I'm all down. But that is it for today. Thank you very much for joining me on this video. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.